Today we've, we've finished the Christmas season. We're beginning the ordinary time starting today or yesterday, the first Sunday of ordinary time. And so we're back to the grind, so to speak. Uh, today's Monday, back to work. And so back to work, back to, uh, we've finished our celebration for Christmas, sort of, and uh, sort of maybe took it, took a little rest, a little, e took it easy and rejoiced and celebrated. And now we, we can uh, see it as an opportunity to, to uh, redouble our efforts to, to, um, to grow in, in holiness and sanctity and, uh, and to um, making plans for the future for our, our betterment. And, and, uh, and that's is what the message in the gospel is sort of today. Jesus, uh, right after the arresting of St. John the Baptist, uh, he goes into Galilee and, and starts proclaiming the gospel. This is the time of fulfillment. The kingdom of God is at hand. Repent and believe in the gospel. And then he passes by the sea and Simon and Andrew uh, immediately cast down their nets and uh, follow Jesus. And and goes on a little further and sees uh, James and John, and they do the same immediately. They follow Jesus immediately. So we can think in those terms immediately. You know, today, no more procrastination, no more putting things off for the future. And I think we maybe we do that because we're discouraged. We don't think we can make progress, and we've sort of given up a little bit here and there. But if we think in terms of uh, doing little little things, uh, little things in the right direction, always putting one step forward, even if it's a baby step, always forward improvement. Get the get the ball rolling, and uh, and see what we can do to to improve things uh, in our spiritual life, in our life of virtue and improvement, and betterment, charity, a better prayer life, uh, um, more more acts of charity, more. A little bit more uh, mortification and sacrifices, little things, little things. If they have to be very little things, fine. As long as we uh, we are in the direction forward, forward to closer walk with God, a little closer union with Him, more prayer life, uh, deeper love for God, and and a better love for our neighbor, doing more for our neighbor, thinking more charitably, thinking less about our ourselves. Always just a little more, a little more better in a better direction, doing our duties more and more, a little more perfectly today. So let's think in terms of today. Today, today I will, I will um, do better. Today, I'm not putting it off for the future. We always have to do something today. Always another resolution, always. So if we lose a day, we can lose two days and more. And we can fall way back. So we don't want to lose any days, but always a day. Every day is given to us as a gift from God. And so let's use this day for his glory. And thank God. Thank God for his mercy for the mistakes we made yesterday. The faults of yesterday put them behind us because God wants us to. And he shows us that mercy. So in, in thankfulness and gratitude, let us uh, put our nose to the grindstone and, and strive to do much better uh, for the future starting today.